Hey guys, welcome back again. I'm MJ. In this video, I'll show you how to fix Windows 10 update error. Like error name is your device is missing important security and quality. So how to fix it? I'll show you for your fix method. So watch this video very carefully. So first and the basic method is you need to set the correct date and time. So go to start here type date and time. Click on date and time. So set the date and time as automatic or as per your region okay so select the date and time as automatic or you can choose as per your time zone and after this select your region so it's a must and should so select the correct region and date and time and after this go to start and go to services here open the services in the services search for windows update here is the windows update double click on it and here disable it okay disable start and stop okay so as you can see disable click on it. stop so service is stop now after this click on apply and okay and after this don't close this window after this go to this pc and go to c drive and then windows folder and here search for software distribution so here is the software distribution folder open it and select the everything right click on it and simply click on delete okay so select everything and delete this and after this again go to services select the windows update here open it and select the automatic and click apply and then click on restart now click on recovery and select the option what I have selected like first flavor restart the service and the second take no action and take no action and here set the value 1 1 and after this click OK and click OK here so service must be running click OK and that's it if this not work then the next option is I go to start here type edit group policy select the edit group policy here okay let me extend it and now extend the administrative templates and now select the windows components extend it and here select the windows update where is it here so just click on windows update and here we'll get a lot of option select the configure automatic update okay double click on it and here simply click on enable and after this click on apply and okay that's it so this is the sorry click on apply and okay and that's it and after this you need to shut down your PC okay don't restart directly shut down your PC so go here and shut down your PC and after this restart your PC okay if it's not work then next option is go to start here again type tax scheduler like this open it and double click on tax scheduler library or you can extend it and after this click on Microsoft and then select the windows extend the windows and here select the windows update where is it okay here is the windows update so just click on it you will get some file here just right click on it and run okay so run the all file whatever file you will get here just right click and run the all file and after this close this and you need to shut down your pc okay so go to start go to power and shut down shut down and after this reboot your PC okay so hopefully this will fix your problem if it's not work then the next option is you need to use the own software so go to Google in the Google just type reset Windows component and open the, the second link this is the link from the Microsoft okay so open this link so this is the official website of Microsoft open this link and here you will get a file scroll down 
and download this file so just click on download windows update reset script for computer running windows 10 so simply click on it a simple file will be download so download the file and after you download simply extract the file right click on it and extract the file and after extract and after extract you will get the folder open it and just right click on it and click on run as administrator and it will open the command prompt so here just press any key to run the script okay just press any key run the script and it will take uh, some time to complete the your this action and after this simply you will need to shut down your PC so as you can see here service is completed task completed successfully please restart your computer and check for the update again so press any key to continue so just close it and reboot your PC and after this try to update your windows pc so hopefully this will fix your problem so let me know in comments which option or which method is work with you so thank for watching guys catch you next video please like share and subscribe thank you very much